Alright guys, I'm out here first evening of the opening day rifle here in Arkansas. I'm in northwest Arkansas. Same property where uh, Steven's dad, Papa Fuller, shot that eight point. Same property and there's a couple other bucks in here. One in particular has a broken leg and we've been getting him on camera quite often. So I'm in here and see if I can't take him out or if maybe another buck shows up that I want to take, I'll shoot it. But I'm self-filming today. Steven's at his deer camp with his dad. And uh, so I'm self-filming here. I got my Pawpaw's old World War II gun. It's an M1 carbine 30 cal. And so I'm out here and see if I can't get it done this evening. This camera in, mounted to the tree. I start to put my camera on with my main camera in the tree. That's the way. It's only about 35, 37 degrees out here, but doing all this makes you sweat. Alright, well, I'm set up in the stand. I jumped one up to come in to the tree. It was actually bedded right next to the tree. I'm not sure what it was, I just seen its butt rant run off. So, uh, I think I should see quite a few deer this evening. Steven's been getting a lot of pictures from this particular property in the evenings. And so hopefully one will come out. In particular, the 10 point with the broken leg, I'd like to take him out, but we'll see. It's about, I think it's about 2.15, 2.30. And we have till about, I don't know, six o'clock or so. So we'll see what happens.
shoot him a couple times. He's actually right there. He's a tough son of a gun. These M1 carbines aren't as po powerful as like your 308s and 30-06s. I mean it dropped him but he's got a bad leg too and shot him a couple more times because he was sitting there laying there suffering and I dropped him but I don't like seeing animals suffer so I thought I'd finish him off with a couple more shots. That eight point came out and I knew that I wanted to wait for this 10 point because he's been coming out every evening. He's not very big, a rat, but he needed to be taken out because he has got a broken leg. And I did it with my pop balls gun. Well guys, here he is. I shot him with my Pop Paul's old gun. He passed away about three weeks ago. And uh, this gun here, it's a M1 carbine 30 cal. And it dropped him in his tracks. I had to shoot him a couple more times to finish him off because I don't like seeing any animals suffer. But I got him. And I know Pop Paul's up there watching me right now. Glad that I'm. It got passed down to me and I'm using it where it's meant to be used for, but super blessed. Thank you, Stephen, for letting me come out here and on this property without you. <laughs> even you, even though you're at deer camp, came out here and got it done. My first self-filmed hunt on camera and I couldn't be any more blessed. That's four bucks for the THG team in one day. I think that's a pretty good day. The bucks are on their feet and some of them are hitting the dirt, but wow. He's not very big, but I'm excited to take him. He's my first deer of the year, Northwest Arkansas buck. Had a broken leg, I needed to get him out of here. He was kind of a bully buck and uh, need to get him out here, but that'll wrap up this episode. Do me a favor, if you guys enjoyed this hunt as much as I did, I got to share it with my papa, I believe he was here. If you guys enjoyed this hunt as much as I did, please, like this video, comment down below, and I hope you guys have a great season. Took a little bit for mine to get kick-started, but hey, I'm glad I could get it done today. Won't you